Hello, subscribers and future subscribers. I'm Karma Jolt. This friend is Safety Servebot. It is the greatest honor to be part of your videos. This game is Secret of Mana, and I am about to do it. Uh, last we left off, we chose, like, a terrible background for the text box. So it's, like, extra hard to read shit. But what the king is trying to say is like, oh shit, you could have our castle because you liberated our town. I don't know if you remember the last video, it was like a month ago, but like, we beat up a wall and uh, the ghosts left the town of Pandora or something. So now the king is like, you can have our, you know, treasures or whatever. We've guarded these for centuries for you, wielder of the mana sword. Well, finally, we're getting some fucking respect because, like, the last village was like, oh, shit, you pulled the mana sword? Get out. But, hey, <laughs> before we do anything, I'm actually going to change the background of the uh, text to something, yeah, something a little more clear. Something Wait, that huh? doesn't hurt my eyes there or your eyes go. or... Hey, let's loot shit! Wow, that's so much easier to read. We got 50 bucks? Holy shit! I'm gonna steal all these treasures if you don't. Who would who would have known that to just make it easier to read, you just had to get rid of all the extra shit in the background? Uh, by the way, we got a swords orb, so that's like something important. Oh yeah, hey, that's pretty cool. If the rest of these are 50 bucks though, okay, spears orb's good too. I could use that. Yeah, in fact, we should do that. We should upgrade our weapons at some point, because if you don't, then your weapons won't be upgraded. And by golly, wouldn't that be the worst? That's, yeah, <laughs> that's my logic. I feel like it's pretty solid. Who's this handsome fellow? Oh, it's a nobleman. I didn't believe it when Jima said you were going to save our country. Yeah, by the way, I know uh, last episode we didn't exactly leave off in this uh, castle of Pandora, but we thought we'd come back because we left the treasures, and I was like, Oh, doy, I gotta go back and get them. It's been a whole month. I can't even remember where we left off. Um, the important thing you have to remember is that we're gonna be going back to, like, the Water Palace and Gaia's Naval, like, a hundred times before this game is over. Man, get ready for an hour-long episode. Yeah, well, no, eventually I'm gonna get frustrated and be like, Okay, I'm done. That's the end of this episode. Uh, <laughs> you know, thanks for watching. Fuck this game. But hey, um... Oh, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> yeah, something like that. For more hilarious video game related comedy. What is this guy doing not attacking right now? Being bad at his job. That's okay. Get whacked, Rabbi. At this point, we don't really have to fight these guys, but it's kind of like free weapon X, even if the actual X isn't that good. And it also helps me feel better about being bad at the rest of the game. <laughs> no, you're, you're pretty good. <laughs> I mean, you fought some monsters. <laughs> I push the B button a lot. Hey, so, I haven't mentioned this in any of the videos yet. Uh, uh, I know we sort of experimented with this uh, last time we were just playing around. Off the screen. Right. But there's an, um, there's an amazing and useful glitch that you can do uh, that involves oh, charging yeah. the weapons. Uh, where basically what, what you do is uh, you either have the computer player charge to like level one or two with the weapon and then set him back to uh to attack at level zero and the game will be like i guess it'll underflow to like a really high value and then his next attack will be like a level 99 attack or something and there's also a way to do it with non-computer characters that we like sort of figured out and then that was like i don't know a couple of weeks ago and since then we probably forgot it right yeah I, I i need i need a bit of a refresher on that but apparently it's something really useful that a lot of people who are good at this game do yeah would you like to try that because we're about to fight at least two bosses this episode i believe oh uh, yeah why not let's have fun for once okay so so yeah that might that might require us like googling something but i'm pretty sure the way to do it 
is, um... Like, basically, uh, if Trash is level 2 with the axe, and let's say Hulk is level 1 with the sword, I don't know if that's true at the moment, hmm. but, like, you have Trash, uh, charge up to level 2, then switch weapons. Right, okay. Something like that. Yeah, I... That's, like, the basically, I got it, and, you know, A for effort is what my teacher would give me right there. <laughs> like, yeah, you basically did it, you know? Now, us millennials and our participation awards. Yeah. Ugh. Which we totally asked for. <laughs> yeah, it was completely of our choosing. Um, but in the meantime, uh, the Mana Seed of Water was stolen from the Water Palace last time we played. And they told us to come uh, about here. Sort of about here, for example. Hey, we can upgrade our weapons. Now we've got the Herald Sword. It's just renamed to Herald. He seems like a really nice guy, so why not name a spear after him? And what do these weapons do? I think the Sprite Spear balloons enemies or stuns them. Oh, oh. shit! Balloons enemies. That's, that's amazing. That's kind, of, that's kind of the best. And then the Herald Sword is effective against slimes, lizards. That's something. I mean, it's no balloons. Right. Gosh, I can't believe I'm saying that. <laughs> I normally hate balloons. It's like part of my character, you know? Balloons are like stairs in in a certain way. <laughs> in like that you make hate a hole them. this big. <laughs> you mean <laughs> sort of big? Like not all that big? Probably I actually didn't a mean to step into this. Dude. Yeah, it's like so what would that be like? Ten feet? <laughs> um, but yeah, like a meteor? Got whips orb, damn. I didn't actually mean to come into this uh whatever we're in right now without talking to Gemma first, but that's okay. Aha! The water seed! It was here all along after we <laughs> stole it and brought it here. <laughs> Whoa, that guy got all up in our personal bubble right there. You know, it was kind of like the same situation where you forget that your glasses are on the top of your head, only with a legendary seed <laughs> yeah. of infinite power. You kind of figured you'd remember where you'd leave that. Because <laughs> it's not every day that you just kind of discard it somewhere, you know? How'd you get in here? I took the ladder. <laughs> you realize we can't let you leave without showing you our dance routine. <laughs> Welcome, we, the Scorpion Army, who rule the world. That's a great is that, introduction. Is that a guy or a girl? I don't know if it matters, but... <laughs> They're very beautiful. Yeah, sick legs. I guess that's basically meta time, and we'll leave it at that. <laughs> because great legs... Great, even greater dialogue. Boys, check it out, boss. Shut up. We took the what? We took the water seed. Not they. To complete our super deluxe robot, we call it Killroy. Guess what it does to people named Roy? It's, uh, it gives him a nice handshake. For what the hell is this hubba hubba shit? <laughs> hubba hubba, do it. Aye aye, sir. What the fuck are they talking about? <laughs> That's like worse dialogue than Trash and Memes have together. <laughs> Which is yeah. seeing a lot. Yeah, and this game is definitely heralded as one of the best written games of all time. Aye, what's wrong? Too much energy, it's out of control. It's killing too many Roys. <laughs> no, remove the seed, use the auxiliary power. I'm automatically just gonna start Whoa, charging up. We're fighting. <laughs> yes. Um, and I'm gonna have I'm gonna have Hulk use some magic here because I feel like maybe that could be helpful mm -hmm. in some sort of way. And some joke about Hulkamania, whatever, it's a kind of okay name. 22 isn't that great of an attack, I gotta say. Man, I got hit so hard I got moogled. <laughs> How does that even logic? Ah, <laughs> oh, I'm out of mana? Okay, I did not realize that we should have, like, slipped at the end first. Ooh, yeah. I kind of figured that once we, when we started there, we kind of slept there. Um, yeah. I would love if Hulk used the whip every now and then. Or at least ghost-rided it. <laughs> that was stupid. I don't know why I said that. 
Nice. Look at this. Spin around and whip. That's oh, like the geez. most effective way to whip. I'm so good at being useless. If you have any mana, you will want to heal yourself. Okay. Yeah. You know, just, you know, watching your HP, dog. Oh, thank you so much. Now, you want to hit Y button, by the way, because right now you're you're using the wrong uh, ring. That makes sense. Why not heal? Yeah, all that's actually great timing right there, because I just you, like, totally hit. avoided. Yeah. That's a thing you can do in this game. So, like, right now, our Shit. spacing is amazing. I said that, like, right before we both made a really bad play. <laughs> I'm gonna get him! Yeah, nope. I'm not sure if you want to Ice Saber me. Like, I'm not sure if that would be effective. Well, let's try it out But I think, I think even if he's not weak to Ice, it, like, adds, like, 10% to my damage. Right. Which is pretty damn good. Yeah, that'll be, like, 8 damage. <laughs> um, Should I use Remedy? If you want, or just... Don't even bother, because I'm already back, baby! Yeah! Big hit! Whoa, his legs turned into a wheel. I was gonna say wheels, but it's just one. Like, I guess that's what happened when he changed to auxiliary power. Right. Okay, I'm doing like 10 more damage now that I'm... Use an ice saber. Oh, I whacked him too. Oh damn! Oh shit! Uh, what's his face is dead. Oh well, let's. Uh, do we have a couple of wishes? We do, but at this point, he's just gonna get revived. Well, I guess he won't get the experience. That sucks for him. He shouldn't have been jumping into those hammers. Yeah, we're cheering because our friend died. <laughs> yeah. Our friend's not cheering because he is dead. Way to go! We celebrated so hard he came back to life. <laughs> you got Javelin's Orb. Not so well, see ya, bye. <laughs> Reco recovered Mana Seed. Do you see that spelling right there? <laughs> Re <laughs> recovered. I didn't notice that uh, <laughs> any other time I played this game. Let's bring it back to the Water Palace. Great idea. You went back to the ship, and there's literally no way to get out of here. Oh no, is there not? There probably is, but oh, I'm okay. being dramatic. Uh, but how do you do it? <laughs> I just... Okay, honestly, I just how do we figure? Gotta... Figured I might make this episode a little more exciting. Well, hey, well, you did it. Hey, at least there's no more Kilroy, right? Well... Can we get out of here using the rope, maybe? Hmm. Yes, oh, we can. Oh, okay. shit. Fuck. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to talk to the village elder because I think he gives you an orb. Okay, yeah, now that's a little important. Um, but hey, I thought I might just spice things up a little bit, something I did completely <laughs> on purpose. You and your spontaneity, you're safe. Somehow you seem older. You know, well, you know what they call me, spontaneous serve bot. Also... I... we are... older, I guess. I mean... Gemma <laughs> took off with some Pandoran soldiers, that traitor. I... okay. Yes. I really... this is not the way we're supposed to go. Oh, okay. Why do you keep going places? <laughs> I just look at where you're facing and then I go. I think we might have missed an orb by not talking to Gemma earlier, and that was like completely an accident. But I'm not sure about that. I mm. could be completely wrong. Okay. One night. Is 15 Gip want to stay? Yeah, I do, dog. I want to recover that mana. Which is something that's, like, hard to do. Like, it is it is hard to keep your mana up at the beginning of the game. Right. Because, because they you... don't give you the right items to do that, right? Well, they're really expensive. You can buy uh, fairy walnuts, but I think you can only buy them from, like, Nico the cat, who doubles the price of them. Right. What's okay? Which one's ready? I don't know. Probably this guy. Why don't you just make them all better? I got a javelin. I got a different whip. Oh, it's black. That makes it better. <laughs> Immediately. So why well, can't this guy just make our weapons better right off the bat? Why does he need orbs to do this? I don't actually know too much about smithery. Um... 
but I trust him when he says he just can't do it automatically. You know? Okay, the javelin has has zero uh, additional properties, but the black whip slows people down. Ooh. So that's sort of cool. That is pretty cool. Anyway, I guess we gotta get out of here now. We gotta walk all the way to the other, you know, place that is... Oh, what's this game expect us to do? Play it? <laughs> yeah, you know, that's a thing that happened with games. <laughs> with, like, early games, like Super Nintendo games. And no other game before it or after it. <laughs> I don't play games now, I ingest them. But like I was saying, we have to walk places. We have to walk back and forth between Gaia's Naval and the Water Palace and Pandora and other things. Yo, you ballooned him! Damn! I'm so good at ballooning things. Between ballooning and slowing down, nothing can harm us. No, that's not true. Nothing can cast harm on us. <laughs> like Dragon Warrior, the original Dragon Warrior, <laughs> with the hurt spell. <laughs> uh, my family and I always imagined that that the the way to chant the hurt spell was something like hurt 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 I wish you were hurt, <laughs> which seems very effective. I will teach you the forbidden spell. Hurt hurt hurt. Not. Don't let this rabbi not get whacked. What the hell is going on here? Yes, it is tradition, isn't it? Mushboom's tangled. He's also dead. Um, He's also just okay, having a let's bad just run day. by these guys. Yeah. No need to slow down. <laughs> Except for that them. one. Well, look, I was way ahead already, you know. So right. Might as well. I mean, I can I can actually one shot them. So. Oh, nice. It doesn't actually slow it down all that much. If I kill Whoa. a fucking flower. Damn! Fuck we're whacking nature. Everything. <laughs> yeah, fuck. Let's go this way! Oh, great idea. Uh, probably around this house and out this narrow gate. Uh, and at the moment, we're returning the seed to the water palace. That is our objective. I completely forgot it, but now that I've remembered it, we can do it. <laughs> right, because the game told us so. And far be it beyond us to go against what the game wants us to do. Yeah, I jumped off of that duck, by the way. I just bounced on a duck. So to speak. <laughs> Get over here, Spritey Sprite. See ya! Oh, Lullabud spaced out. That's what happens when you've got a balloon on your head. I don't know if that's some crazy Japanese thing, like, oh, you're so spaced out, a balloon grew on your head. <laughs> kind of like how, like, when you're asleep, you have to have bubbles coming from your nose. You yeah. know what I mean? I have a feeling it's kind of like daydreaming. Like, you're inflicting daydreaming on somebody. So they're really distracted. Damn, look at these fish. These fish some Those fish. fish are the same fish from the palace to the left, by the way. Right, the ifish. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we did talk about this already. They have names. Water Thug. <laughs> spaced out. Damn, what a gangster. He doesn't need a gun or a shank. He's got a trident. I, I thought it was a fork, but trident does sound better. I mean, yeah, it's technically a fork. I mean, it's a trident is a type of fork, isn't it? Is it not? Look at me <laughs> outranging this thug. Damn. This thug slash gangsta. And listen to this music. It's like, oh shit, the water palace is in trouble. <sighs> Safety serve bot. I'm really good at video games. You're great at pushing my buttons and unpushing my buttons, so to speak. <laughs> Whoa, we just triggered a cutscene. Luca! Get out of here fast! My name is Trash. <laughs> Who have we here? I'm Jestar of the Empire. Are, was he like trying to introduce my, himself like, Oh shit, look who it is! It's me, Jestar <laughs> of the Empire. <laughs> Hand over that seed or Luca's had it. Make way, it's me! <laughs> it is I, Yoshimitsu. <laughs> Don't! What will you do? Run. Run away. I'm gonna fucking run. Idiot! Whoa, did he just like yank us back with a whip or a grappling hook? Ouch, can't move. <laughs> Brilliant observation. <laughs> the dialogue in this game is just so good. Ouch, can't move. Like, that's 
that's their way of paraphrasing, ah, I'm under some sort of spell and I've been paralyzed. <laughs> it's just out, can't move. Ah, I never would have guessed that. So glad the seed's here. Too bad we have to break the seal. I think that means he's got a P. Right. Stop it. Well, nice to have met you all. Gosh. Well, at least he's polite. Uh, as a little gift, I'd like you to have my little pet. Remember to little feed him a little. Damn! Is this Kilroy? <laughs> no, this is Roy. Yeah, this is just Roy. I thought it was just Kilroy leveled up. Hey, so, um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bug you about, um, okay. keeping my HP up. I can do that. And I'm gonna use Undyne's magic. Oh, damn. To reduce Jabberwocky's defense. Do you want me to use any kind of augmentation spells? I don't really know. Um... But I'm gonna see if Earth Magic does more than the Water Magic here. Whoa! Alright, I'm gonna heal. Oh, he's got me stunlocked. Yeah, it's sort of... Okay, oh. okay, okay, okay. Um, <laughs> yeah. Um, wait. Yeah, attack him. For sure, do that. Oh, okay. Um, or not. I didn't... Oh my. Okay. Pure Water, here we go. This is what yeah, I yeah, wanted. Yeah, yeah, here us all. How did I get turned around there and and with? I used my level two attack in the wrong direction. Oh dang. Okay, so I'm just gonna keep using level ones from now on because those have some good range. All right, we got rid of Roy Prime. Now let's get rid of the uh, whole shebang. I wonder if I can slow him down. Whoa. By the way, um, I'm knocked out. Spell spamming is like super effective against us. It's right. also really effective against them. Right. Is there anything that I should use currently? Yeah, use like a gem missile on him. Ooh, I do have that. Uh, yes. Well, Hulk does. That's for sure. By the way, yeah, I don't know if you noticed that, but you were opening Hulk's menu and not your own. Whoa! How was I doing that? X button instead of Y button. That is. Oh. Well, hey. Uh, now that this guy's only got one neck to flail around, he's, like, not as difficult. Yeah, he's not as scary. And I'm gonna gem missile again. Great idea. Bopped for 93 damage. That's so good. Hulk's unconscious? It really doesn't look like that. Oh, he's all out of his magic, so I'm yeah. gonna use mine. Uh, yeah, use, like, Defender on us or something. Or yeah, on yeah. Hulk, at least. Yeah, let's use that on Hulk. He could use it. Yeah, because he keeps getting whacked. Jabber whacked? No. <laughs> That's not a thing. I might have just canceled out your attack. Oh, I man. Apologize. Well, we well, killed hey, him anyway. Doesn't matter. And some one of us got a level up or something. Or a weapon level up? Shit, that guy exploded! Everyone explodes the same way. It's just like the Mega Man X series. We're cheering so hard that we're all already alive. I don't know what I meant by that, but we got the Bose Orb! <laughs> I, I think you meant that we feel alive, because we did so well. Hulk's magic faded. Uh, that's really What's this shit? The Imperial forces have drawn back. We managed to defeat their monsters in Pandora, too. You mean I did? Like it was just us? You're saying we, like, oh, I'm totally part of this team. I got this from one of them. You should have it. Got whip's orb. Damn, we just upgraded our whip, and now we're nice. gonna upgrade it again. They Trash. really want us to use this whip. We're running out of time! For what, exactly, though? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure what we're in a hurry about. We already got them all defeated. What? What is there left? Only a restored mana seed can be the form. Oh, you've got a legendary artifact called the mana seed? Well, it could be a restored one. I'm just saying. <laughs> I mean, you shit on my parade like that. That's a phrase. Talk to the cannon travel man in Potos. He'll send you to the upper land. That's like heaven, right? Meaning he'll kill us? <laughs> now, use your sword to restore the seal put on the seed. I have That's no idea what's you. going on. We're restoring magic or something. Important plot points. Receive the seed's power. Again! Pure evil seeks the seed now. Okay, it's hard to read the text without a background now. Just in this place, though. You must hurry and revive the mana sword. 
you know how I explain that. Go to the lofty mountains and see Sage Joach to learn about real courage. Cause you ain't got shit. <laughs> you fucking coward. <laughs> Then go to all eight of the world's palaces and reactivate all the seeds. I could mark them on your Man. map, but like, just Google it. You will be able to receive mana power from the seeds once you reactivate them. We gotta do this shit eight times. I have business with Sage Luca. Goodbye for now. Um, I'm sort of sick of this game, so let's just say that that's an episode. Yeah, who wants to play this game anymore? Anyway, thank you all for watching this episode of Secret of Mana. Until next time, this is Karma Jolt and... Safety, sir. But... Signing off. Until next time, tell your friends we're great!